the Bat Hound, sniffing at the best ASA softball bats there are. Today I'm here to bring you a bat review of the 2021 Monster Banger USA. This is an exclusive by Headbanger Sports. Zero swings on it. We're going to put it on the radar using the Worth Hot Dot Cycle Ball. S-Y-C-O. Let's go for it. 95 miles per hour. This is a two-piece bat for ASA only or USA only. ASA and U it used to be called ASA, uh, 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 what must be American Softball Association. Now called USA Softball, but same thing. Come on, Banger! 94 miles per hour. So this is a torch repaint, uh, Monster Torch from 2017 and newer, uh, which makes it a 25 ounce mid-loaded bat with the floating inner barrel. Now, a sticker weight is gonna be 25 ounces, but uh, these are both torch repaints here. This is the Unicorn Sports Magic Stick. Uh, one of these scales in at 25.4, one scales in at 25.5. Uh, so it's gonna be right around that midway between 25 and 26. So again, sticker weight is gonna be 25, but on the scale, uh, plus I'm using uh, hockey hockey tape with the balloon grip. So it's, you know, if you're using a thicker tape, uh, it'll be even heavier. So this is relatively light. So again, this 25.4, 25.5, plus it being a mid-load, it's going to swing a little bit heavier. So, I mean, for a 25 ounce sticker. So if you hear 25 ounces, you think, well, that's just too light for me. Uh, it's going to swing heavier than, say, if you pick up 25 ounce, uh, what would it be? Like 25 ounce Demerity Mercy. That's going to swing considerably lighter than uh, a 25 ounce torch. 89 miles per hour. Oh, come on now. Now, uh, as far as torches, I've had one torch get to the 97 mark right out of the wrapper for me. That was the uh, Allegiance by Revolution Athletics. It's a, a exclusive for 2021. I've had two of them reach 96 right out of the wrapper, and that's the Legend by Unicorn Sports and that Magic Stick right there by Unicorn Sports. Let's see if this one can do it. 95 miles per oh, hour. Oh, we're one short. Go for it now. Come on. 97 miles per hour. Hey, there you go, Baker, USA. Out of way. So again, that makes this, it's, it's only the second bat besides the Monster Sinister to get above 96. So I right out of the wrapper. So I've had a lot of Sinisters get 96. I've had a couple Sinisters go above that. Hey, how are you? Good, good, thanks. Uh, so I've had a, a number of sinisters going going above 96. Now I've had two, two torches get above 96. There's only been, so that, the only bats that have got 96 even have been sinisters, three, to, uh, three torches, uh, four torches now, and then uh, one other bat, which would be the Anarchy Pitbull of 2020. That way here, Banger USA! 93 miles per hour. Come on now! 93 miles per hour. Now the best out of the wrapper speed that I've gotten for me has been the Monster Unleashed. You know, I think the adrenaline was going that day. It actually had a 98 and had a 99. So, but this I'm very happy with so far. In terms of looks, it looks fantastic. Look at that. It's got a gloss finish on it. Look at that. You know, a lot of bats, the paint stops right there. And I, you know, I don't know. I wish they would go just a little bit longer, you know, two, three more inches. But, you know, that's, the, that's on most of them you see. 94 miles per hour. Sound. Uh, you know, the torch is always going to sound, it's going to be a great sounding bat. It's going to have a nice clack to it. Typically, it's going to get that clack, a nice smack. It, it'll be there. It has a nice sound right away. But once you get that up around 500, 600, and if you can get 700, 800 swings on it, it is going to sound fantastic, and it's going to be ready to go. So it's going to start out good, really good out of the wrapper. 
I mean, for me, typically I'm not going to, even though this starts out really well, uh, it's not ready for the game yet for me. I have other bats that are broken in. So it'll st still take a while to get there. But it's going to perform really good out of the wrapper. Oh, that wasn't good. I mean, if you want a bat to really reach compression really fast, that would be like the Worth Creature, uh, Worth Mach 1, the Mike and Primo. Uh, so this one, I would again, I would say probably around 700, 800, even, you know, if you can get up near 1,000, this will be really ready to go, ready to get in the game. 96 miles per there hour. Oh, come on, banger! Again, swing weight, it's going to swing a little bit heavy. Uh, I feel like it's just real smooth. Uh, the, the handle knob is going to be a mid size. DeMarini, Mike, and are going to be on the larger side. Anarchy is going to be on the smaller side. This one's right in between. Uh, and I find the, the handles on the torches are nice and thin. I have a sinister where the handle's a little bit thicker. Let's see this one here, the unleashed. That uh, handle might be, feel a little bit thicker but pretty close. Now again, uh, Sinister is my gamer. Uh, this is the same bat in the, uh, te same back technology in the barrel. Uh, this is just the difference between a two piece and a one piece. 95 miles per right. hour. Now this is the M2 composite. I'm gonna go try a couple swings with the M5 composite. This is the flip money. Got a review on already on this. This is over 400 swings now. We'll give it a little update, see how it does. This is the pipe technology two piece bat with a half ounce end load. 95 miles per hour. All right, there you go. Go chase it now. Let's go. 91 miles per hour. Now it's pretty comparable in terms of sound. Uh, it's a little softer barrel than the torch there. This is a 26 ounce, came in 25 ounce and 26 ounce. Again, this is mid-loaded, or uh, sorry, half ounce end load. 93 miles per Come hour. Come on now, Flip Money, let's go! 94 miles per hour. All right. So the torch stopped doing it with no swings. 94 miles per hour. All right. Let's give a couple swings with the uh, the partner there, the uh, M2 composite as well. Again, this is a sinister 25 ounce one piece mid loaded bat with the floating inner barrel. Lots of repaints out there of this and the Monster Torch. Uh, so, but anytime you find a uh, one piece bat by Monster that's 25 ounces mid loaded with the floating inner barrel, it's the same bat. Now, in theory, for a repaint of the torch, the sinister, or any bat, in theory, once they're both, you know, all the bats are broken in, they should perform the same in terms of all the sinister repaints should perform the same. All the torches. There might be some difference in terms of handles that you get. Uh, so this handle is a 2500 flex. So you can tell that because it starts with a two. Uh, this here, the banger, is a 30 that's going to be either 39 or 3500 because it starts with a three uh usually because if it only comes in one handle uh stiffness or flex and it if it only comes in the one you only have the one option it's most likely going to be the 3900 that seems to be the most popular right now uh, this is the 2500 let's see what you can do here unleashed 97 miles per hour just one swing at a time. Now take the lead. 98 miles per there hour. There you go. There you go. That's why you're the gamer. And I mean, it has more swings on it too. 96 miles per hour. There you go. One more for you. Go for it now, Unleash. Let's go. 96 miles per hour. So again, so all torches, in theory, once you get them all broken in, they should be the same, but there might be a difference depending on what handle flex that you go with, or you might find one swing uh, is better for your swing. But in theory, they all get to the same performance. 
Now, out of the wrapper, they might be a little bit different. Some might be a little bit more ready, depending on the way the metal came together or whatnot, or the mix of the metal. I don't know all the science behind that. Uh, that's just my understanding. Be sure to check out the bat on that com. 94 miles per hour. I can, I can definitely tell the difference between this and this that uh, unleashed, just kind of on contact. That was definitely more broken in. Uh, check out the bathon.com. There you'll find used bats, uh, merchandise. You know, that's a good ways to support the channel. Most of the bats I purchase with my own money and review them and then sell them on the website. That's a good way to help unbiased reviews coming. Uh, the merchandise t shirt on there that's a uh, multi blend. 95 miles per hour. I recommended products and more. We're going to give it one more here. Oh, 91 miles per hour. One more. Go for it now, banger. 95 miles right, per hour. There you go. If you're looking for one of these brand new, it might still be on the Headbanger website if there's any there. Uh, they were 305 after taxes. Uh, so if you're once those are sold out, one brand new I'm guessing is going to be around 325, 350. If you're looking for one used, I'm guessing 275, 280. Uh, and there you have it. Congratulations on the banger! The second bat, other than the sinister, to reach above 96 right on the wrapper, hits the 97. Maybe we'll go for the record right here, banger! 97 miles per hour. Hey! Tied it! There you go! Alright, there it is. Feel free to leave any questions, comments down below. This is the Bat Hound. Everyone sounding off. Be sure to subscribe to the channel up here. Check out some other videos up here and down here. Thanks, everybody.